if you want to set up the project on Linux, here's how you do that. Now, I'm going to be doing this in code blocks. If you're using a different IDE or build system or what have you, then I'll trust that you know how to do that in there, but this is the example I'm going to be doing. This is how I'm going to be doing it, I should say. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and create a new project, and you can actually select... Where is it? Somewhere in here? Ah. If you're using code blocks, you can actually select an OpenGL project, and it'll do a lot of setup for you. But I actually don't want that. I'm going to be doing something different from that anyway, so I'm not going to bother. I'm instead going to go for a console application. So, I'm going to click Go, and it brings up a wizard. I'm going to do C++. You can write it and see if you really want to. I don't. And for the project, I'll say OpenGL Tutorial Project. <laughs> made the same typo too. OpenGL Tutorial Project, same as on Windows. And click Next. And I'm going to use the GCC compiler. You can use whatever compil compiler you want. I just like GCC. So, yeah. And click Finish. And look, it even creates the Hello World program for us. Although actually I'm going to be using STD manually, just to be consistent with Windows. So, yeah. You can leave it as is if you want. It, the whole point is a test program. Oh right, I'm a Linux now. The build hotkey for this is Control F9, so it should build. And if it just press F9 by itself, it'll run. And hello world. Excellent. So now, at least we have a program that's set up and runs. Now to actually set up the libraries. And if you're not afraid of a terminal, setting up the libraries is incredibly easy. So I'm going to hit Control Alt T. That's the hotkey for bringing up a terminal. If not, you can always just search your computer for it and execute it like that. But here's the terminal, and here's the command on Ubuntu Linux. If you're not using Ubuntu Linux, or if you have a different package manager or something, then this might be a little different from you, for, for you, but for Ubuntu Linux, the command is sudo apt-git install. That installs something on your computer. In this case, we want libsdl2, which is the library, sdl2, dash dev, which is the development library. And it'll ask me for my password. And, of course, I already have it installed, but for you, this should fully install it, do a whole bunch of setup for it, and it'll be nice, and whatnot. And other than that, we'll, of course, need the rest of them, which is libglue-dev, and sudo apt-git install lib... Oh, what is it? glm-dev. And there! So now we have all the libraries set up, and installed, and with all the ridiculous folder nonsense I did on Windows already done for us. So in fact, what we can do at this point is right-click on the project, go to Properties, select the Project's Build Options, and if you're on this page, make sure you have this part highlighted and not Debug or Release, otherwise the project's going to break once you change your build target. So yeah, just make sure this, is, whoops, this part is selected. And then from here, just go to Linker, that's the only tricky part, by the way. Go to Linker Settings, and just type in the name of the libraries you want to link, and then you're done. So I want to link to OpenGL, which is just GL. I want to link to Glue, so just type in Glue. And I want to link to SDL2. And GLM doesn't need any linking, it's a header-only library. And at that point, just click OK, OK, and it should be able to include something like include gl slash glue.h, control F9 to build, and run, and cool. All the building, linking, and all the DLL nonsense on Windows already done for us. No need to, to do anything else. So there you go, that's setting up the project on Linux.